What's going on guys? It's me. It's sort of early. It's 8 o'clock now, but I've been up since 5.50 with my dad. Hi dad. And we are driving to Columbia. If you're not from South Carolina or you don't know the geography of South Carolina, it's about two hours away from Charleston. And I was looking at a car on Craigslist that was posted in the Myrtle Beach Craigslist. Then after talking with him for a while, he said that he had it posted there, but he lives in Spartanburg, which is three hours away. But there's a football game this weekend, so he's coming an hour down this way, meeting in Columbia, gonna check out this car. So, we're about a half hour away from being there. Let's check it out! Alright, it's cold, so I'm gonna keep this short, but... <laughs> a little me out of it. It's got... It's got teeth on it right now. This is it. I'll show you more later, but it's cold right now. Okay, I'm inside of it now. Heat's on. Got this nice nardy wooden shift knob. If it'll focus. Alright, whatever. And handle. Parking brake. Got this. I'll do another overview when it's not so cold, but it's cold right now and we gotta get on the road. It's another two hours back to home. Let's go. Built. Two months ish since I bought this car, and this is also part of the process of getting caught up in videos. So, I did sell the BMW, like I said in the Dotson video. If you watch that, if you haven't watched that, go watch that now uh, if you want. So, now I'm getting caught up on videos, and I've had this car for two months almost now. So about time I show it to you. So we're going to drive out somewhere where I can give you a nice overview. It's really nice out today. It's been like 30s, low 40s all week, and now it's like high 60s, which is great. So let's go make this video. Let's go check out my new Miata. My battery just died, but it is now up again. So now you can sort of see in the light of day what this car looks like and what my tripod looks like but overall this car is in such good shape the leather's nice and soft just little scuffs here and there but like that's not a rip it's sort of hard to see in the light that's just a little sort of fold in there um, the driver's seat does have some cracks in it but it's still very plush and it's definitely still got that bolstering in it. So let's show you the, uh, the trunk, I guess. Oh, and the hood. We'll pop that while I'm at it. So the more boring stuff. The trunk. Nothing new here. Oh. This is a little piece that goes under your dash, like under the steering wheel. And I was driving downtown, and downtown Charleston has really crappy roads. And I literally hit a pothole so hard that this thing fell off and fell into my onto my feet as I was driving trying to use the clutch and whatnot so it now lives in the trunk at least for now until someday when I feel like fixing it until then until that day it lives in the trunk got some mold in the trunk not even gonna lie it's pretty disgusting right there um, there's a water leak somewhere I think around the light housing or something not 100% positive but yeah it's I don't know it's a trunk what do you expect? 
Now for the good stuff. And by good I mean pretty pretty basic looking engine. Okay, so this car is fairly stock. Um, it seems to have had its radiator replaced at some point because that's looking newish and freshish. You know, it's not that brown, brittle plastic that's ready to crack and explode. Um, it's got a racing beat air intake, which is, I don't know, it, it's nice. You can hear it, the intake, so it sounds pretty cool. Um, other than that, there's not a lot to see in here. So, things that aren't stock are that air intake, and then it's also got an exhaust on it. I'm not sure what brand it is, and I know there's a leak in the exhaust somewhere, because I've been under there and you can see it, but it sounds pretty nice if I do say so myself. The tip sticks out a little bit, but <laughs> I think it looks cool. It's not too ridiculous. It does have a little bit of a tip sticking out, but nothing crazy. Yeah, that, that's really it. There's not a whole lot to it, except the dust on this lens. It is just a nice little 97 Miata. There's nothing super special about it other than it's mine, and it's actually really clean. Um, I'm not sure if it's been resprayed. It looks like maybe some parts have been resprayed. But overall, this thing is just really clean, and I'm really happy to have it. It's going to be such a fun daily driver. As I try to put down this hood prop with one hand, it's not going to happen. I'm just going to have to wait. But it's going to be such a fun daily driver. It has been such a fun daily driver for the past two months. And yeah, it's great. So, thank you so much for watching. If you stuck around to the end, thank you very much. Be sure to leave a comment down below, like the video, and subscribe. And when you hit subscribe, hit that little little icon, I think the bell icon, and then that way you get notifications when I upload videos. So you can see cool stuff that happens with the, the Datsun, the Miata, and anything else. Also if you want, you can share the video, you don't need to, but helps my channel get out there and helps me grow. Alright guys, thank you so much for watching, once again, take it easy.